Them shoes are uncomfortable and tight. I buy them so they for work and I go work and my God if I kill me. And the funny thing about it is look at them brother and ugly already. My foot broad but not so. I'm a bike a half, half, half size up and it don't make no rough sense. Yeah, excuse me, I'm a gem. I look for Brinky. I look for a little snack. I'm just going to buy one bread to make breakfast. Oh, more I'm planting to. But I look for Brinky for snack for later. I can't. I'm not saying anything. I don't have any. These are all the snacks for them to have. I'm not saying anything else. But. Why am I like on and I'm not exposing the semi vlog? Anyways, the, the, um, the more ripe it is, I guess are the better because sometimes when they get the right plant, them, them kind of carbine. Some of them kind of carbine. I like when my, fr my sweet fry plant um, overripe sometimes. That's one more. I like how them when they look. They when they look too over it. This is my base color, get everything on my wall. Me buy the francs, them at the shop, but call the francs, them. Cheaper. People are looking at me. Francs. Oh, my bad. It's not covered. Ah, you still are retired. People are looking at me, so I'm going to go. I'm going to go. So I'm gonna like squeeze bumping on my face. But them I did have a squeeze because them two here had blackhead. This, this, and them two bump here when I tell them they always I come up. Me have to take out that one here blackhead. Alright, so, so guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Friday. Um weekend of course and it's also emancipation weekend, holiday weekend, so I have no work on Monday, so it's gonna be a restful weekend. I have work tomorrow, but I have no work Monday. I am so upset. Next week's gonna be a short week though, but I am upset that we won't be able to get next week. Well, not Monday coming, the following week Monday as well, because when Monday coming is Emancipation Day, and then the following Saturday is gonna be Independence Day, and the rules i changed a long time ago that whichever day the holiday falls on if it's not a sunday it's gonna be recognized on that day so normally if independence day would fall on the saturday they would bring it over to the monday but it's not like that anymore i think them say bruce golden they change that it's not so anymore so it's gonna be the saturday which is like a regular day anyway so I don't know yeah guys so i don't really have anything planned for the weekend i would love to say that i'm going to the beach or the river but that's not so but my not complain because i really need a rest so but tomorrow though i plan to meet up with a friend a friend of mine that she and i used to go maths and limited together she and i did cake subjects together and me and i will meet up for drinks or dinner or something she's younger than me but um she was like one of my favorite people when me go maths unlimited at the time and i kind of learned that over the years like whichever capacity i go in no care how much i resist i always find one person that i take with me for a lifetime or throughout life even if not forever at least one person and she's one of them so um i'm looking forward to that but separate and apart from that i really have nothing planned for the weekend i think that i came on camera to say something you know but i don't remember i don't remember what it was I really want to show the two t-shirts my best friend buy me but guess what now i have no tripod my tripod broke my tripod break 
the ring light, not the, well, I shouldn't say my tripod, but you know, some have a tripod, I like me, I tell. I have a tripod, but the tripod that I am talking about is the one that is on the ring light stand. But as it relates to a tripod, I do have a tripod, but my ring light stand breaks, so. I mean, I have no way for kind of propping it up and show, you no. Know? But I guess my photo is laid flat on the bed and show it too, you no. Know? I think that is what I'm gonna do. It, probably not tonight, though. Probably another day, tomorrow. Yeah, because I'm not really in the mood tonight. I want to go take out something for where I go work. I also want to take out something from now so I can wear for meet up with my friend because I like to be at that time. My ears are fair, come and I rush and I think what I'm gonna wear. I like to be ahead of time always in everything so i'm gonna kind of do that now and get myself ready for in the morning so see you guys in the am all right guys so i decided to show another shirt them tonight because my old mama skits and look for something for where go about my business tomorrow um she want and package food, no? Why? And she bought them from Fashion Nooper. And she devious because she know me like Bob Marley, right? And then she actually sent me the shirt, asking if I liked it, pretending like she was actually purchasing it for herself when she was actually buying it for me. Okay. That is one. This is the second one. Second, oh shit. I think it's a, it just says flex, and then this look like a bunny rabbit in her hat with her glasses and her hoops and her chains. And I, and <laughs> I think that she thinks that this bunny rabbit is a representation of me and it's size medium and this is also a size medium yep so that's it show me a chat full niche so that is it guys i'm gonna post it on whatsapp now so Hey guys, Saturday, I'm at work. Um, I'm about to leave anytime now. But I just come for make a comment. I was scrolling on TikTok a while ago per usual. And I saw a video where somebody, I think it was Nightly Fix, they reposted some tweets that Kimberly Megan made. That is Idonia's wife, who no know me, you want that. And she was basically saying that something wrong with Jamaican crowd because they're not around for stand up stiff and the artists them as opposed to when them in a Europe are work. No. I agree, but them always say a king never get crowned in their own country. And then another thing to it is that you have to understand, say, probably Jamaicans have a mentality where them don't used to you already and then the outsiders them you are fit them on a celebrity you know but we used to you so outside you'd have be celebrity to that be just like a Nicki Minaj or Michael Jackson or whoever to we them are something big and great but to them family them are just them family so I guess to, to, the, to us Jamaicans the artists are just our artists and to them they are just celebrity and I mean, when other celebrities, like a Nicki Minaj, when she perform maybe in America, she might be get the same reaction as to where should I get in a Europe. 
But if you take the same Nicki Minaj and put her in a Jamaica for perform, the same Jamaicans them will say them love Nicki Minaj will stand up stiff on her same way. And she not up there do not know nothing any less than what she do in a Europe and what she do in a America or anywhere else. And I always say this, Jamaicans will humble you. Is a crowd or humble you? And I said Jamaicans never give people forward because people perform and then get them forward. But you have to really be doing something spectacular for more of a Jamaican crowd. I don't know, but you can't fool we. When you come, you have to bring your A, 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 plus, plus, plus game. Don't feel like, say, we are going to stand up and pay our good money. I go pay our good money. And when you come on stage, it's like, oh, as Skilly come out on stage and the people them start say, wop, 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 wop. That is not Jamaicans. That is not we. You have to bring your A game come. That means so when you start perform, wop, wop, wop. To all y'all whop we in our skin, we don't have no choice but to say whop, 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 but that is just not us. You understand? And as an artist, you can't make that deter you. Yes, I know see a lot of people might feed off our crowd energy. And I remember when me and Mag, when my sister and a Magnum, and I usually go there go watch, and the judges then usually give comments a lot of time, and I say, some of the time, don't even watch the crowd where I react. Because sometimes when the crowd start reacting, it get you thrown off of your performance. Sometimes the crowd are react, you're not going with nothing. Maybe we're not the crowd or your friend or your family or whoever, but you're not going with nothing. Or sometimes they are performing, you might see this crowd stand up stiff, and you feel like say, you're not going with nothing. But really and truly, they might enjoy the performance and them just uh, listen. So what she is saying is facts, and it has some amount of merits to it. But it just simply means that only need for change upon the A game. And I watch these artists year after year on these shows. And they don't come with proper stage presence. They don't come with proper stage carafe. They don't come with proper stage costume. They just come with the same typical dash, pull up. Like, no. No. You need people come for here when you perform them song, them favorite song. DJ out the song, sing out the song, at least give you one full verse. Don't just as the sad song start and you want to get a forward, then you dash. You want to break the concentration of the crowd. So maybe that's why as you know, go down in a performance, there is no reaction. And that is just Jamaicans, they are easily distracted. We don't focus for too long. And just look at the rumors, just look at the news. You have a viral person, will it be a mackerel a candy wall a saloni whatever it is somebody can just bust in at the media and then we are running on the media for two three weeks straight one month too if you're good like that and somebody else come up on the scene and jamaicans just gone with the wind that's how we are we not we not we not we not we're, 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 we're easily distracted we don't stay focused for too long so yeah, the people I'm in Europe and wherever I was sing out on a song and make on feel big and special. Not that we're not big and special, but we are a different crowd. We're very humbling. And I love that for us. So I just basically um I look for wrap up now. It's like 146. And I go in a bashko. As I said, I go see my friend. I hope she doesn't mind being on camera. Um, I don't really want to dress up too much because it's a simple girl and I don't really want to try, you know, like me, I try do the most. So, I kind of have an idea and I'm going to up what I'm going to wear. And then again, the outfit we're going to wear, I think I'm going to be wearing the outfit for she, if you know what I mean. Because, you know, she she always gives me, like, you know, good look of compliments on my outfits and stuff. So, I'm going to wear something that I think she's definitely going to also like. You don't want to wear some makeup, but my makeup brush them dirty, my makeup sponge them dirty. Like, as a hot girl, I'm gonna like that for me. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna go in a bash and see if I can get like a chocolate fair because I want like a fatty, you know. But I've not seen her in a while, so I don't know if she's still like fluffy. But when I say fatty, I mean only in the body sense. Like she love our food, she love our snacks and stuff like that. And I'm a type of person, I like giving people stuff. So she might not be expecting to make a carry little snacks and stuff like that for her. 
I think I'm a kind person. My family will say I'm a mean person. I'm gonna know how them come to that conclusion because I give them the best gifts. I always give them for them birthday and special occasions, but I think they mean that I mean in a sense whereas I mean with my stuff and I don't think that that makes me mean. I don't like sharing my stuff and that does not make me mean. So yeah, I think I'm a kind person. I'm a very loving person, especially if I goes for you. So when people hurt me, I take it really hard. So with that being said, um, when I leave right here, so I'm going to bash for but see if we can get like one of them big chocolate bar that we are and maybe Pringles and any other else thing we must see we catch my eye when I know say Raquel would I love. Yeah, so peace. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Okay everybody, that's Raquel. Alright, so we reach our hundred now. Everybody, I look for me. I don't know how me stare when it comes to vlogging and public, so I'm going to stay too long and do that one for some of the cars. Yeah, but I'm reach and I'm going to chat and catch up. Raquel, I'm going to wait for Thank you.